Gold Rush Update Mining for gold isn't a job that just anyone can dive into it demands. Dedication, a deep understanding of the trade, and a good level of physical fitness to achieve any real success. Moreover, having a substantial amount of savings is crucial as acquiring the right equipment is key to making any discoveries, although some might assume that the stars of the Discovery Series Gold Rush get financial help with their equipment costs series. Regular Tony Beats reveals that those expense has come directly out of his own pocket in Season 11 Tony Beats spent around $7 million in total, a staggering amount by any measure. However, Beats explains that he and his team wouldn't have committed to such a hefty expenditure unless they deemed it absolutely necessary plus they had the financial resources to make that investment confident that it would pay off in the future as both a miner and a businessman beats is incredibly money conscious after all the lure of big earnings is what drew him to mining in the first place for most investing millions of dollars in any profession would be daunting but for tony beats it's not a huge deal his team is well equipped to handle such financial pressures and he's not one to be careless with his money from the very beginning of his career, Beats has been focused on financial success, yet while the potential for profit is a major motivator, he also genuinely loves the work and still thrills at the pursuit of hidden treasure. Considering he spent millions on equipment alone, it's clear that Tony Beats has made quite a success of his mining career so far on Gold Rush. Machinery breakdowns are a significant source of tension each team has a limited window to extract as much gold as possible so any downtime even just for a few hours can drastically impact their profits this raises the question would these teams be better off taking things slower to avoid frequent repairs redditor us psalm zone seems to think so they noted on all the gold rush shows they always end up cranking up the shaker deck and the water pumps as fast as they can go to get more dirt through the plant is this a sound business practice faster production means more dirt passing through the plant but it also means far more wear and tear on the mechanical parts this is a valid point as pushing equipment to its limits inevitably leads to more maintenance issues the reddit discussion attracted some individuals with professional mining experience such as us slash robob fraud who shared their perspective at real mines we usually run near full capacity to push tonnage but we also have full-time mechanics people in charge of tracking and stocking every spare part and personnel whose job is to schedule and plan shutdown so that as much maintenance can be done in as little time as possible it's it seems the reason why everything is always running at full power on gold rush and its spin-offs is simple it makes for more exciting Television Gold Rush, the popular Discovery Channel series offers an inside look at the high-stakes world of gold mining where teams of miners put everything on the line in search of fortune beyond the grit determination and drama that fuel each season of vital aspect of the show is the array of specialized equipment that makes these ambitious gold mining operations possible from massive excavators to intricate wash plants each piece of Machinery plays a critical role in the minor quest for gold excavators are perhaps the most recognizable and essential machines in the gold rush arsenal. These heavy duty machines are responsible for digging deep into the earth to uncover gold rich pure equipped with powerful hydraulic arms and large buckets. Excavators can move vast amounts of dirt in a short time, allowing miners to access the gold beneath the surface the size and capability of these machines vary depending on the scale of the operation larger excavators like the caterpillar 349 f used by tony beats can move up to 100 tons of material per hour making them indispensable for large scale mining without these machines the sheer volume of material that needs to be processed would be impossible to handle manually once the pea is unearthed it must be processed process to extract the gold and that's where wash plants come into play a wash plant is a critical piece of equipment that separates gold from the surrounding dirt and gravel the pea dirt is fed into the wash plant which uses water and mechanical action to separate heavier gold particles from lighter 
materials there are different types of wash plants featured on Gold Rush, ranging from portable trolls to massive. Shaker decks each design has its advantages, but the goal remains the same. To maximize gold recovery, Parker Schnabel, one of the show's most successful miners, often upgrades his wash plants to improve efficiency and increase gold yield, illustrating how essential these machines are to a successful operation. Bulldozers are another crucial piece of equipment on Gold Rush, primarily used for clearing land, creating access roads, and pushing. Massive amounts of overburden the dirt and rocks covering the pay dirt out of the way these powerful machines are indispensable for preparing mining sites and keeping the operation moving smoothly the Caterpillar 10 often seen in the series is a popular choice due to its power and reliability by clearing large areas. Efficiently bulldozers enable miners to reach per more quickly ensuring that precious time isn't wasted the success of the miners on gold rush depends heavily on the equipment they use from the massive excavators that did dig deep into the earth to the intricate wash plants that separate gold from dirt each piece of machinery plays a crucial role in the operation as the series continues to evolve so too does the equipment with high-tech innovations helping to increase efficiency and reduce costs ultimately the equipment is more than just a tool it's a symbol of the miners determination and resourcefulness in the face of immense challenges as viewers tune in to watch the latest season of gold rush the they can be sure that behind every nugget of gold lies a story of hard work innovation and the relentless pursuit of success thank you for watching this video